the last character to be revealed for the ultimate pack is finally here and boy doesn't she look scary. Your flesh looks tempting. Yeah, you're not the first to want a piece of me. I'll have more than one cage. Right off the bat, you can immediately notice that Melina in MK11 is quite similar to how she is in previous games, relying mostly on her incredible speed which makes her one of the deadliest combatants in the series. When it comes to her moveset, I have to say that there haven't been many surprises because most of her legacy moves from MK2 and MK3 are back, with a little bit of twist to them here and there. For instance, her teleport kick which was initially borrowed by Kitana in this game is back again but unlike her sister, Melina can amplify this move by adding another kick and a throw which can place your opponent in the corner for even more punishment. Another classic Melina move that is back is the ball roll and this move is used in her fatality but what I really look forward to the most is the brutality associated with this move. I really hope that there will be more things involved rather than just obliterating the opponent's shins like the case in MKX. Now if you're not into the legacy moves and you want to see something new, then the role can be replaced with a brand new move called the Conum Dash, which is a super quick low followed with some awesome mix-ups and the best part, this move can be amplified to maximize the damage. Now to complement her assassin character, Melina has a new ability that we've never seen her possess before, not even with the power of Shinox amulet in MKX, that ability is invisibility. Melina in this game can turn completely invisible during attacks, making her opponents oblivious to whatever she's going to do next. Now we cannot talk about Melina without mentioning her signature weapon, the good ol' size. In MK11, Melina retains the classical Psy Blast and they can be amplified by throwing double low size similar to MKX. However, there is a brand new move associated with her size and it is called the Psy Drop, where she slides one of her Psy on the ground and the player may decide when to lift it up and from there it will come back down to crush your opponent's skull. Aside from that, Melina also has a bunch of other throws and grabs that we've never seen her do before, but what's most important is her lovely friendship which is one of the cutest things you can see in this game. <laughs> so what do you think of Melina's moves and looks? Let us know down in the comment section below. For more, make sure to like the video and subscribe to Gamelution. Come on.